What is inflation? Inflation is the increase in the general level of prices for goods and services and a fall in the purchasing value of money. Inflation can also be defined as a measure of the increase in the price of goods and services over time. It is calculated by comparing the cost of a fixed basket of goods and services in one year to that same basket in another year. The average level of inflation in the United States is 3%. This means that prices are rising 3% every year. Inflation is measured as an annual percentage increase in the price level. It is usually measured as the percentage rate of change in a price index, such as the Consumer Price Index CPI. Inflation can be caused by an increase in demand, a decrease in supply, or both. Inflation can also be caused by a decrease in the value of money. The consumer is affected by inflation because it increases the cost of living and makes it more difficult to afford basic necessities such as food, housing, and transportation. The main cause of inflation is an increase in demand for goods and services. This can be due to population growth, economic growth, or both. When there are more people with more money to spend on goods and services, prices will rise because there are more people bidding for the same amount of goods and services. Interest rates are used as a tool to control inflation. If interest rates are increased, it becomes more expensive to borrow money, and this reduces spending in the economy, which in turn reduces inflationary pressures. It is important to understand the concept of quantitative easing and tightening to control the supply of money in the market, as this can have an implication on interest rates and inflation. Quantitative easing is a monetary policy in which the central bank buys securities from the market with newly created money. The Fed has been printing money since 2008 to stimulate the economy. The printing of money is when central banks create new money electronically, which increases the supply and lowers its value, causing inflation. Quantitative tightening, on the other hand, is when central banks raise interest rates to slow down inflation. This can be done by raising the interest rate on loans or by selling government bonds to take money out of circulation. This causes inflation to come down. Inflation is a term that is often misunderstood. It is not always bad for the economy, and it does not always lead to a decrease in asset value. Inflation can be good for the economy as it helps in growth of asset value in the long term. For consumers, inflation may mean higher prices on goods and services, and a loss of purchasing power as their income might fail to keep up. However, for individual investors and asset owners, it might mean that some of their assets, such as real estate, may benefit from inflation or at least keep up with its pace.